Today is the day where many of the most important people in the art world from all over the art world will come and see what a great show we have in the halls. People don't understand how, how Mark Spiegler and the Art Basel people go through the galleries and make sure that the, that the finest is brought here. But in terms of the, of the parties, most of them are parties uh, that the galleries invite their, their, their clients to. It's not different, by the way, in Basel, Switzerland. It's just not to the extent in Basel that it is here. There's more people here than ever before. But what they're doing is a lot of the staff people are staying over in the city of Miami at the Hilton and, and, and the Marriott hotels and so forth. So I think you, what you're seeing is that the city hotels are really benefiting from the fair as well. There's so much to see. I would encourage people from the public to take the time to go to the public sector in front of the Bass Museum. It's a really, it stepped it up yet another level. Um, and it's free, so it's a good place to start visiting the show. Um, and aside from that, I think it's really a question of what you like. There's everything here. There's the youngest artists from the farthest away countries, and you have the great stars that everyone knows, like Kandinsky and Picasso. You can come to Miami Beach and have a party experience, or you can have a seaside experience, or you can have both. I know a lot of collectors who, having done the parties for a few years, now see this as a time when they come to Miami Beach, they take a long walk down to South Point every morning. They have bookings at all their favorite restaurants. We know there are a lot of great restaurants. And of course, they really take the time to see the collections of the show. So I really don't think that the choice is come to Miami Beach and party or don't come at all. I really think there's another, there's a totally different modus vivendi that people can enjoy.